this is the first criteria. Okay. What? Yeah. You don't remember? <laughs> what? Sorry, I'm. <laughs> you really listening? I'm a little bit listening. I'm so, working also. For example, Dina uh, yes. last week was here with us, and today maybe she can share uh, how she managed to go through her last week. Yes. <laughs> and maybe I will share as well my. my The huh? And so many of them. Hours. So. Yeah. What is Um, personal branding agency. So I do like client work and, and that's the actual business that I want to build out. And so actually putting focus on, on building out that. Um, okay. And then the second thing is choose day. Working out. Yes. So what is working out? Um, going to the gym. So I want to start working out again on a daily basis and so Can you then rewrite it go to the gym because you can also Oh yeah yeah here and yeah. do like two push-ups and <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 yeah Yeah going to the gym daily yeah Yes uh, oh, no you actually want to perform for us <laughs> Perform. I don't, how, how about you try it now and uh, try it. So we'll we'll push but then I we'll then I would be working on push ups all week. But that's a good thing to start. Yeah, yeah, that's a good thing. Gym, you know, yeah. It's a miserable thing. No pressure. Well, no yeah. pressure. Like two, and then I'm. Uh, then you know when next week you have to do like five. <laughs> so it doesn't matter where day. you start yeah. from. Yes. Yeah. So the absolute max. Yeah. That's the real What's like thing. normal? What's like? Is it? There is no normal. normal. There is no normal. How many can you do? You look fit. Ah, uh, boy, I haven't done something in a while. I could probably do like 15. I really? do two. I haven't done them in a while, but I don't know. I have to do them properly, huh? Yeah. yeah do what? Nice. One, two, three, uh, easy. Three. Three. Wow. Well, one more. Yeah. Oh. That's super cool. Well done. So how many do I have to do now next week? I reckon you could aim for like 25. I mean, I could have done 25 now, I think. Okay, so 30 then. Okay. Go for 30. So next Monday you can do 30, right? Yeah. Next week I'm going to be sore. Yeah. <laughs> no, if you start on Tuesday, you will be sore on Wednesday and Thursday, so you'll have time by next Monday. 30, yeah. push, 30. Wow, that's getting interesting. Yeah. <laughs> Monday. Yep. There we go. Yep. All right. Thank you. So what you just saw was called Intention Monday, which is another event they actually organize here at the house, um, where people from the house and other people who want to join from you know other places in Bali can join. And the purpose is basically to set your weekly goals. Um, everyone sets their goals. You can set up to two goals. And then there is an accountability group chat, which I'm not sure whether I'm gonna join because it's on Facebook and I de deleted my Facebook Messenger. Um, and where people keep each other accountable, whether you're actually working towards that goal. But one thing that I took away from that is that, um, for these goals that we had to set up, um, there had to be important goals that we actually care about. Um, they had to be measurable, so it needs to be something where you can actually, you know, see whether you achieved it or not. Like saying something like, I wanna become a better writer doesn't work because how do you measure whether you actually got better? But for example, saying I wanna write for 30 minutes every day, that's measurable, you can achieve that or not. But I already did that with my goals, 
but um, we also had to break them down into a habit that we can do daily. So for example, when you're writing something, um, instead of saying during the week, I wanna finish this writing project, because then that's not into a daily habit because you don't know like, are you all gonna do it on the last day or on the first two days? But actually saying, I wanna write for one hour every day so that I get it finished. So then you can know, okay, I do something every day. And that's actually super interesting. Um, so I'm gonna do that now, from now on. Like actually think, break down, your, like define your goals and then break it down into a daily habit. Set a big goal and then see, okay, what do I have to do on a daily basis? Whether that's a certain time commitment to it, whether that's a certain repetitive task that you do every day to move towards that. Um, but it needs to be something that you can track daily. So remember the place we went to two days ago um, on our first night? This place. Um, I just got a membership at this place, which um, which I'm gonna show you, mainly because it has a gym, but it also has all of these other facilities you can use with the membership. It's like 900,000 rupiah, is that the, is that the um, currency here? Um, which is like 55 euros. And for 55 euros a month, you can use a basketball court, use a skate court, which I probably will never use. You have massive pools. Um, there's the gym, there's like, I think like a dance room where you can take dance classes, but you guys know I'm already a pretty good dancer, so I don't need that. And um, well, all kinds of stuff to hang out. They have a restaurant, obviously for the restaurant, you still gotta buy, um, for the restaurant, you still gotta pay for the food. The food is not included. Yeah, so it's mainly for the, for the gym and the sauna. They have a sauna too that you can use. And I wanna show you the card actually, because I forgot the name of this place show you so the Titi Balu Ubud Club um, so yeah my plan is so you guys saw the weekly goals one of them was to work out every day starting tomorrow so I just got the membership to do that what up um, I don't know if you guys know, but um, I started a thing on LinkedIn with my friend Ben Bradbury to um, hold each other accountable to consistently co post content because as you guys know, I'm doing this whole social media thing and I'm doing the daily vlog, which goes out approximately once a day. Um, and then I'm posting on Instagram, which is also a lot and um, LinkedIn. I know a lot of you guys don't follow me on LinkedIn, but I post a lot on LinkedIn and a lot of what my business is about evolves around LinkedIn. And so I, and also my friend Ben, we both wanted to keep each other accountable to post consistently on LinkedIn. Um, and so we said we both have to post four times a week. Um, and if we don't post, so there is a punishment, a penalty, we have to donate $50 to a charity we don't support. Um, so if you, you know, if you don't hit the four, you lose 50 bucks. It's still on a good thing, but it's a charity you don't fully support. So it's, you know, kind of weird in between. And uh, today's Monday. And so from last Monday to yesterday, Sunday, I posted three times, um, which means I lost, which means I just donated 50 bucks to UNICEF, which is um, the, the charity I decided. Not because I don't like UNICEF, I actually think they're doing good work, but I worked for Save the Children last year, and so usually if I had the choice, I would go with Save the Children for anything humanitarian or um, you know children in need. Um, just wanna show you guys proof, you know? Just so you guys can't bullshit me, you have sent a payment of 50 bucks to USD to UNICEF USA. So, and that should not happen again. So, um, yeah, that were 50 bucks I didn't plan on. Um, and it did its purpose, purpose because I just posted on LinkedIn. And um, 
I will make sure that this won't happen again. But on the flip side, it's also kind of cool. So yeah, I'm actually gonna wrap up the the <laughs> wrap up the vlog right now because um, I actually still have a client call to do. Focus. Um, in like half an hour at 10 p.m., which is my 10 p.m., but the client's 9 a.m. <laughs> Talking about time zone differences, right? Um, so I'm gonna do that. I still gotta do my emails and then I gotta plan my day tomorrow. We gonna go to the gym for the first time. I'm getting those gains and that's about it. So thank you so much for watching and then see you next time, which will be tomorrow. Peace. Hard to wake up when there's no alarm to wake you up Sitting, breathing, doing all the things I hate a lot But why now? Holy shit, I just wanna make it